Here we are guys, welcome back again, it's UK Airbex. Give you a tour around. We are at the Star Pub today in Brighouse. This is the uh, main entrance. You can see the writing on the back of the door here. You can't actually see it from the outside because there's a metal shield over it, but from the inside you can. I wouldn't say it's in the worst condition, but it's not in the best condition either. So it looks like there's three floors to this building. So this is the ground floor we're on now. And you can see there's an old fireplace down there. I'm just taking it to this other side of the building here. It says on the bathroom there, the main entrance. Few yeah. Places. It would have been a pub or something, I wouldn't find it. But what, what? You can see that was a fireplace. There's two yeah. fireplaces there. Just yeah. Like, yeah. I'm trying to think how old this pub would have been because it looks like it would have been something that's closed fairly recently in the past couple of years. I mean, the damage is quite bad, but it just looks quite modern yeah. from the outside. It does. It. Nick's already got that in. There's a nice hole in the wall <laughs> over there if you didn't notice that. Just in case Nick didn't show you, but. Down here, we can see a fire alarm, it's not been pushed yet. No, Nick, you're not doing it. Mm -hmm. And just down these stairs here is the basement where all the beer and stuff would have been kept, I'm guessing. But there seems to be a lot of water pouring down here and it's quite damp. And there's wires just hanging everywhere. If we go to the right in here, we can actually see a few leftover beer. Yeah, it's in that corner over there. Look, guys. There's actually a water leak over there. So the water supply is still definitely on it. And there's one of them things what you'd use to like get the kegs up. Oh, yeah. It sounds like we do a water leak upstairs at one point. It's quite a cramped area as well. I mean, I'm not sure what them hooks were for on the ceiling. I've never really worked in a pub, but... There's a lot of kegs yeah, down there. Hey Nick, are, them kegs, are any of them kegs actually full? I don't know. You want to try and like, grab all the ones, see if you can move it? I'll enter. Boom, gasp. Things down there. Do you think the gas still works? Oh, and there's, it looks like maybe the boiler, is it? And there's so many cobwebs. So if you don't like spiders, you probably don't want to walk in here. Because it is absolutely covered. There's a lot of white nails and stuff there. Next room is just uh, similar to what we saw before. Um, See, that's is that oil? Like some empty oil can over there? Yeah, no. That's a vent, some kind of vent. That's another sort of glass. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff under. Uh, guys, look on the wall here. There is actually. Is this light still working, this place? Look. The electricity is still on. Huh? The electricity is still on here. And it's still working as well. They've turned off stuff. So that's what I mean, it can't have been abandoned too long ago. What's that saying there? Sell the lights. Yeah. Shall I try it? Yeah. Yeah, just sell the lights. Nope. Guys, so we're back again. Uh, we're in the yard now. Is that like a sink? I reckon this is like a blacksmith's or something, maybe, back in the day. Blacksmith's? How many years are we going back now? Because if you look at it, it's very old and <laughs> dated, sort of thing. It's back to the original brickwork. Yeah, and look down on the floor as well. Yeah. See what what would that have been there? Would that be in where all ash goes? I don't, I don't know. Yeah, it's like a drain or some sort. Yes, yeah, so that's like the the door from the main road, but that's. It is an old-fashioned door, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, camera a bit up, Nick. Look at the beams. Yeah, they look very old. They're really old. old. Yeah. 
see, this is like a horse stable or something. Look, it looks like that's where hay would have been kept. It does, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. They didn't have had horses in here. It looks a bit like a stable. Yeah. <laughs> like a pub slash stable. Yeah. There's probably a lot more history to than we actually know, but we'll have to get back to you guys on that one. Yeah, we'll have a look into the history then. We'll get back to you and all the info about this building. Hopefully we can find out quite a bit about it. I'm not sure what this is, guys, but if anybody knows, they can what leave a that? comment below. Wow. That's just like a dust mask. Dust mask. Here we are. We're off upstairs now, guys. I'll just cut till we get up to the top of the stairs. So this is the upstairs bit, guys. You can see it's quite derelict. It is really bad up here. Yeah. You don't even feel safe walking on the floorboards up here. Well, really? it wouldn't work anyway, but... You can see all the roof as well. See, and this... When you look downstairs, it looks really modernised, doesn't it? And kind of like it was abandoned two years ago. But when you walk up here, you're thinking you're walking into the 18th century. Yeah, it looks like it's been abandoned for like 70 years. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's, cause it's just so... The condition up here is terrible. It is. Staircase and stuff, guys. It looks beautiful that staircase. It does, I do like it. It's, like it's still got the original hammer rails there, which is quite interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With the iron feature and stuff. I do like that. And look at the roof as well, it's kind of like it's all old fashioned style, like wood styled houses. It's not like brick, is it? It's made yeah. out of wood, this place. But if you look, guys, you can see there's a lot of gaps in the floorboards, so you can actually see down to the ground floor. We don't normally film the floor, but I thought I would do on this occasion. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully I don't stand on this and end up through the floor. This looks like it was like a kitchen area here, or maybe a bathroom. What was that in there? Well, I actually thought that would be a fireplace. Here we go, it's another room, guys. It's like got some tiles on it. So I reckon this was a, probably a bathroom at one stage. It looks I think like everywhere's a bathroom now, don't we? Because we've seen some tiles. Look at the brickwork here. So if you look at the top there, look, it's like an archway or something. I don't know if you can get a better angle from move across this. I reckon this place would have been so many different things at one point. It is, it's, it's the right archway there. Well, do you know when you look outside as well? The, the really modernised houses just surrounding this, uh, and this has just been left to rot, but it was such a nice big property. I'd love to see back in the set, like. Back in the heyday. Here we are guys, and if you look again, this looks like a, it would have been a disco room or a ballroom or a dance stage or something like that. There is so because much to this room. You can, you can see where the glitter ball is on the roof. What are them things dangling from there, Nick? They're, they've got like little faces on it if you look at the, if you get onto this angle there, you can see little faces. Yeah, it's like a Halloween party or something. <laughs> Maybe that's the last time it were open, wasn't it, on Halloween? Oh, on Halloween, yeah, and there's two pint glasses over there, there's a pair of ladders down there. Yeah. This feels concrete here, doesn't it? it does, that's yeah. weird. It's on the first floor, and it's there's like yeah, concrete. I, I, See, I know, that's, that's, yeah. if you look, guys, there's all this artwork on the the wall here. Yankee Ellie and a few other bits and bobs. What's it all even say? Someone in twenty year. Oh. Fake love bite. I don't know. Do you know what, at least the artwork's a little bit better than we normally see. So. Yeah. Wait, is that, can I see someone who's called Jack? I hope that's not me. Could be, in 20 years. Take my money, 10 bar. It's quite wow. interesting. Look at this. I do not know how long these have been here for, but they look ancient to me and they're all dusty and disgusting. But if they were part of the pub when it was in its peak, then that is amazing to see. Yeah, I reckon these are left over from the pub. It's a shame though, it doesn't have any like logo on it, because most of them do have their own logos, don't they? Yeah, but you see. And there's just like a lot of shit down here, like a DVD disc and all that rubbish. Well, I reckon the pub's been closed for at least 10 years. Yeah, the electric's on, but it doesn't work. Because <laughs> <laughs> there's no light bulb in it, you joke. Uh, like an old beer mat there. Do you guys know what I bought? Is it Abu? I bought ale? I've never heard of that in my life. But there you go, that's a... Uh... Yeah, that's <laughs> the only thing the fan was probably like what used to be part of the pop was being left behind. And there's a fan up there, did you notice that fan? You see there's an extractor fan there, that guys. Used to be a stage. I think that used to be a yeah, stage. It was a stage, you could tell by the floor, yeah. Yeah, disco thing, they need to have a stage and a DJ up there and they don't have all the